<sighs> All right, so there's a certain type of ray that I want to talk about. And this is actually should be plural because they're rays and they're what we call as opposite rays. So what exactly are opposite rays? Well, think about, let's just look at a ray. Remember a ray has an endpoint and then it, maybe it might be, let's try this again. A ray has an endpoint and then it, goes infinitely in one direction. So let's call the endpoint P, and let's call it, it go through a second point K. Now it goes infinitely in that direction. So I have the ray P K, and that's how I'd represent the ray P K. Now the opposite ray of P K would be a ray that's gonna have the exact same endpoint, but, and goes through a point that is not K, but that's actually gonna go in the opposite direction that's gonna create a straight line. So I'll try to do my best on creating straight lines. And let's say it goes through the point uh, L. Now, the ray PL is opposite of the ray PK. And the reason why it's opposite is because it contains the same endpoint but it goes through a point in the opposite direction, it still continues infinitely. But now when I create, when I put these two opposite rays together, what I have done is I've created a line. And whenever you have two rays that create a line, you have opposite rays. So I hope that helps out. If you have any questions, comments, comment below. Thanks again.